Taurus, welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for May 12th until 18th. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Taurus, if you are looking for a new, uh, new house right now, make sure that you will be knowing all the details because I feel like someone will be lying to you or someone will not tell you the real details of the place that you are looking into or that you want to buy. Now, on the other hand, it seems like there is an air sign. Who Actually, two. There is an air sign who will be giving you much joy and uh, satisfaction. But it comes to your personal growth and happiness and it seems like there is also love that will be budding in the air especially if you're single now some Taurians will be moving into a new place or a new house it's just that be very careful with the people that you'll be talking to or if you want to invest into real estate properties or you know like flipping houses Make sure that you will be knowing the history, the uh, the repairs and everything else, or why is it that the uh, the property is being sold out at a very um, cheap price? You know, of course, oh, there's always something that's in return for that, or there's something that's in exchange. But you have to know all the details because otherwise you might just spend more than what you have paid for this property. Okay, now there is someone who lives far from you or that you are thinking about. Okay, that you're still, um, that you're still in love with, that you're still thinking about, that you still have a lot of feelings for, that you have tried to move on, but this person just keeps on lurking into your into your mind and into yourself and into your heart. It seems like you have been like, you know, it seems like you've been. Um, Um, it seems like you've been trying to forget about this person. And this is an air sign who's already a mother. A bit, uh, just a little bit older than you, not so old. But I feel like this person is very mature, driven, goal-oriented, very ambitious. But that is also what, you know, what divided the two of you. Their ambition. But then, you've already reached up to the point that you have tried to escape and you have tried to run away from this person but it's still them that's still in your heart okay so this week you will start writing some creative stuff about this person poetry songs or whatever it is and at the end of it you will be convincing yourself to reach out to this person okay because they've been waiting for you for such a long period of time and i feel like you know this person still have a lot of feelings for you so it's time for you to act on it and it's time for you to stop denying these feelings you know inside of you because it's time okay now as i've said that there is an air sign who will be uh giving you a lot more joy and meaning and you know you were so afraid of getting rejected by this person because you've well, it's not really like a direct rejection, but you have tried to, you know, make them wait for a year for such a long period of time. And you're so afraid that by the time that you're ready to come back, they might just reject you. But you will be very surprised with their answer, okay? So obviously, they're, they're going to accept you and they, they're also going to be very happy. Now, things will start moving and changing in a positive direction this week. And you will also... You know, start looking more into the horizon or what will be better for your future. Even though you will be cutting off some toxic people around your life that you feel like, it, you know, they did not really serve you well. But instead, they just took advantage of your generosity and they just used you for whatever benefits they can get from you. This is a week of growth, a week of um, reflection and also... You know, pulling yourself out from the situations that you've been stuck to in the past. And I feel like you will be very, you know, uh, you'll be very, um, like, reserved. Or you'll be very, um, what do you call this? Like, you will be reserving that significant space for, for more meaningful and valuable people that will be more helpful to your growth. And not for those people, it's just going to be there for you just because that they can benefit or they can gain something from you. 
okay now there is somebody from the past or there's somebody from this is not the other ear sign but this is more of a recent past that's also trying to that you've been trying to go out and date out together but it did not really work out because you know the thing here is you're looking for whatever that's missing you know in your life to this person and you're trying to feel her or you're trying to you know to um you know like you're trying to address her as the other person that you're still in love with but you know the, the thing here is that's um that's wrong even though they're of uh, the same signs it's not really right okay even if we are under the same signs and stuff like that we are still you know different individuals we have our own different personalities and unique talents and uh, personalities and stuff like that so it seems like this person will be one of the uh, you know those people that you'll be letting go or that you'll be cutting off this is the most recent one okay and even though you've already shared a few memorable times or memorable things in the past you know that it's much better for you to walk away now rather than make them believe that you're, you know, that you're going to fall in love with them someday. All right. Which is, I feel like that's a brave thing to do. Because you want to straighten up your path. You want to rectify your mistakes. And you know that you cannot find the personality of another person to the, uh, to the person right in front of you, even though they're of the uh, same signs. Okay. You're just too... You have to admit to yourself that you're just too intimidated by the other person's ambitions. That's why you veered away from them. Okay? But if you really love someone, you have to learn how to love the, you know, the things, the people, and everything else that they love too. Okay? Because they'll be needing your support. And you should be right behind them instead of standing in front of them now work wise it seems like you'll be more aggressive and i feel like you will be more energetic and uh, you will be using your instinct during this week because someone will try to set you up for like uh, you know so that your your boss will get upset with you but then you will know right before it happens okay it's um, actually three people around your work who will try to betray you and set you up. But then you will get to know who these people are. And you will know definitely what are they up to. So right before that happens, you're going to nail them and confront them. And chances are they might lose their jobs because of that. Now, moving on, it seems like you will also be, you know, financially happy and financially secured starting from this week onwards um especially until the end of july and uh, you will be getting the bonus or you like a there's an extra money or resource that you'll be getting and you'll be very happy now instead of splurging and instead of uh you know doing some um spur of the moment shopping i feel like you want to save your money and uh you know, invest it into something that is even more valuable. That someday you know you can reap off the, um, you can harvest your, you know, your hard works and hard labor. And it seems like some single Taurians will also start looking more into settling down, getting married and uh, committing, and you know. Um, stop playing around when it comes to love. And this is the start of good for you, Taurus. Now that you're starting to learn more about your, you know, start to learn more from your experiences. And it seems like you'll be more settled. Okay. So for those who is trying to be with a Taurian, or for those who's, um, you know, is already with the Taurus right now. Expect that there will be some growth, maturity, and more commitment. Um, they will also be more verbal about their, you know, their expectations. They will also be humble, you know, because um, they're very aware of what they have caused and done in the past. For, for I mean, for the past few years, 
for the person that they're with and um, I feel like this is the start of their you know brand new beginnings and self growth okay personal growth and um, I feel like they'll be more level-minded and balanced okay now financially I don't see any other problem it seems like this is the time that you really need to be more wise with your money because you know it doesn't really happen all the time but then your money will start picking up and you will start investing more into real estate for some reason I feel like Martorians will be more into buying houses investing into you know um, real estate buying lands uh, lot properties flipping houses or something like that or you know some of you might get involved into real estate selling or brokerage okay anyway that's it for you for this week Taurus and if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live the calls just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net blessings to you